I went to Costco and here's what I got. I didn't get too much. I was trying to shop for the whole month, so I went to Costco and Trader Joe's, and um, so I didn't get too much. But here's what I got at Costco. I got this bag of frozen green beans. I got these cans of black, organic black beans, and I got some ground turkey. I'm going to be making some breakfast sausage, um, which I'll do a recipe video on that um, coming up here shortly. And we're going to be doing some chili, some turkey burgers, and some other stuff with this. So I thought we'd give that a try. I also got the organic ground beef. This is the one that I like. And it comes with three of these packages, and so I divide them up into three, um, which is a little bit less than a half pound each, so we get nine um, dinners out of this. Um, I got two loaves of our favorite bread, and then I got this avocado hummus. Um, they've sampled it many times when I've been there, and I've always wanted to get it, so finally I just broke down and got it. And I got these chips here. These are really good. I've got them before, and I got them to dip in the hummus. And then I got some bananas. I got some extra ripe ones. Well, they're getting very ripe, and then ones that are still a little bit green. And uh, this is our favorite salsa. It's medium, so it's a little on the spicy side. Well, not really spicy, but for me it is. But I, I really like the salsa. And then I also got some cocoa powder because I've been putting it in my smoothies for breakfast. So that is what we got at Costco. Oh, and I also got a bag of um, softener salt. Here's everything I got from Trader Joe's. I have not gone in months, so I was so excited to go. And plus, they opened a new Trader Joe's sort of near us, and it's a lot closer than the one I usually go to. So that was exciting. Um, so first of all, I got this basil plant. I'm going to be making some pesto, and this was the only basil they sold, so I got one of those. And I got two bags of carrots. I got regular carrots, and then I got these carrots of many colors. And there's orange, yellow, and purple ones, and those are really good. Um, I like to roast them up and I made some baby food out of them. I mixed the colors and Miles liked it. Um, I got some celery, some uh, organic mixed baby kale. I like this better than the Tuscan kale. I put this in smoothies and it doesn't have as strong of a flavor as the other kale. I got two bags of romaine hearts, some organic russet potatoes, um, some tomatoes, a red onion and parsley, and this is for the turkey burgers. You're supposed to mix this in with the meat, so we're going to try that and see how that works. I got one loaf of this bread here. Um, I really like this bread, and it's only $1.99, so I got one of these, even though I got some from Costco. I still like this one, so I just got that. Um, and then I got these British muffins. They're kind of like English muffins, and I like to eat them with my turkey sausage. Um, I got some flour tortillas for burritos. I really like these hamburger buns. Um, this is, I love this sourdough bread. I usually make this with garlic bread when we have uh, pasta or spaghetti. Um, I got some tater tots, because we're going to have tater tot casserole, which I'm not a big fan of, but I'm going to do a little bit differently, so we'll try that. And I love tater tots, so those will be good. And I got some peas for chicken pot pie and soup. And then I love getting this at Trader Joe's. I actually got two of them and it's just frozen um, bell peppers and I love having these in the freezer because it's all the different colors and I can just pull it out for lasagna or spaghetti or um, fajitas or stir fry or something and it's in the freezer I don't have to worry about going to the store and making sure that bell peppers on hand and it's all the different colors too so that I love having this on hand in the freezer that's why I got two of them I love this black forest ham. I got it for sandwiches for Simeon. Um, if we don't have leftovers, and he can, I can make him a meat sandwich for work. And then I got this chicken sweet Italian sausage. It's uncooked, and I've got it before. It's really good. Um, I do it in spaghetti, and then also have a recipe that I'm going to do with um, lentils and this. So we're going to try that out. That'll be good. And I got brown jasmine rice, and I got this. Um, rice medley. It's got wild rice in there and dehydrated carrots and a bunch of seasonings and I cook it with chicken broths and it makes a really good side dish. Um, I got some of this whole wheat pasta and I got regular spaghetti and then I'm gonna try this. I've heard this stuff is really good so I like to get different types of pasta noodles because we have spaghetti or a pasta type dish once a week every Monday and so I like to change it up with different pasta noodles. Um, I got one container of the 
almond milk original and I use this in soups and like uh, biscuits and stuff like that where I don't want to use the vanilla almond milk and this is a treat for myself I love this blueberry coconut yogurt um, it has a pretty strong coconut flavor which I'm not very fond of I'm not big on coconut but when I mix it with granola it's really good so I just got one because it is I think a dollar 49 or something um, so I just got that for a treat and I'm going to be making granola. I also got some eggs and two bags of mozzarella cheese for pizza and lasagna. And let's see, I got some brown sugar and powdered sugar because we were almost out of those. And I got a can of coconut milk because I'm going to make pumpkin pie and um, it's a dairy free recipe and it uses this. I've made it before and it's really good. So I'm excited to make that. I got some roasted unsalted sunflower seeds. We love these in our salad. And I also got some pecans and my friend who gave me the pesto recipe uses these instead of pine nuts, which I'm not big into the whole pesto with pine nuts thing, so we'll see how that tastes. Um, I got two of these boxes of cream of mushroom soup and I really like these because it doesn't have the MSG or any other junk in them. Um, so I'm going to use this for the tater tot casserole and then I'll also make green bean casserole with those. Uh, which is, I got these french fried onions for that. And I also have another recipe that I made last year with leftovers of these after I made the green bean casserole. So I'm going to attempt to make it again this year. I didn't make my notes on how I made it so hopefully I can figure out how I made it again. I got three cans of Great Northern Beans because we're going to be having white chicken chili and that'll take two cans and then I'm going to add a can of it to our regular chili that we'll have in another time. I got some taco shells so we'll have burritos one week, tacos another week and then I got these um, corn chips. Normally I get the ones from Costco but I just decided to get this bag and then I got five jars of this pasta sauce. It was only like $1.79 and it's pretty good so I got that instead of the normal one that I get from Costco and I got some chocolate chips because I'm going to make some granola bars and possibly some cookies. So that is everything that I got from Trader Joe's. I spent $128 I think it was for all this stuff and hopefully this stuff and the stuff I got from Costco will last us the whole month other than maybe a few produce items that I'll have to get um, halfway through.